heart was in my throat my heart was in my throat i was scared okay i did i didn't even remember that i was a youtuber god ow ow First of my channel, welcome. I am Joe Joe. Please do not to take a seat, okay? Sit down, you know. Make sure you like my video, share the video with your friends, subscribe to my channel. Like, it's very, very important, guys. Like, okay, we need to talk, okay? We need to chat. See, it's been a very, 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 very stressful period and everything has just been happening back to back let's try to do one back center but yeah we are live thank you all so much for reaching out to me i really really appreciate your concerns thank you for your messages your calls i was like oh are you sure you're yeah, okay are you safe oh yes i'm safe thank you and i got out of the place you see i want to say this here if you're actually outside your country it is very 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 essential for you to have a student union okay because our uh, student union was just like created like a few months before this whole thing started like just a month eh? and even though for that thing you know, you don't know you don't know whether we'll be stuck inside the place but yeah we thank god for taking us out of the SAV all thanks to our student unions president and all the other officials and all the yeah. so okay let's get into the video i just want to tell you guys the process uh so how we left you film and everything here yeah. so the thing here is that for me and the people in my city we were not really really like attacked okay because my city is far away from the places that we are attacked we are, we are kind of in the western part so we are actually safe but you know you should not be taking chances with things like this because we don't want to wake up and then we are born my heart was in my throat my heart was in my throat i was scared okay i don't know i was just scared about so many things because if you guys notice my last vlog was about me traveling to Kiev, and just a few days after we go back from Kiev, he was born like ow ow i'm like so what if we were still there we'd be panicking and so many things would just go wrong <laughs> put it in a try there's no lie Putin did not try. I don't know why I keep looking at the apartment over here. I meant to be looking into the list. I don't know. Right, so we had like a student meeting like um, online on Google Meet before we actually left um, my city. So we spoke with our um, student union president and some other Africans as well. We're going to be. Then we had like a meeting point. We all met at that meeting point where we actually took off. See, the Q from the place where we're meant to be no from a particular supermarket before the meeting point here was very long like cars were actually stuck there was no movement they had to just you know park and just stay in the queue because the queue was super long before you get to the border and then when we got to the border like the border the um before the slovakian border because we actually went through slovakia some people went through, through poland through romania and hungary but we went through slovakia see it was long the queue was long i will show you guys um videos that i made because i didn't see that i did i didn't even remember that i was a youtuber god <laughs> i did not remember but hey um, <clears throat> i said it that my heart was in my throat i was not thinking straight all was in my mind was that I should actually just leave here because I, I was scared. <laughs> I didn't even remember that I was YouTube at all. I actually made like updates, like videos for my parents and my siblings so at least they could follow up on our movement and be sure that we're actually safe. So those are the videos I'm going to kind of like insert inside this video so you guys can and see. Let me tell you something. The worst time to be on your period and be cramping so bad is when there is a war attack. I hated myself. I was uncomfortable like most of the time. And I ate when I wear dress for a very long time, like from morning to night. We were there for over 20 hours under the cold. You know me not all cold. 
I don't like when the weather is very chilly. I can protest myself but like standing under the cold and just struggling. That was survival of the fittest. They could have been stampede. But like these people are actually really pampered. They was like they gave us food, there was enough to drink, they gave us hot tea. I'm impressed. Even black hair to give us, so that one was actually really helpful. Although, you know, like my city was not attacked, but I still kind of like felt really, really down because there were people that actually stayed under the cold and actually died through it. Like, something could have happened, everything could have gone wrong. I was there, we were trying to fight to get out of the border, and I was thinking, what if they throw bomb? <laughs> What did we get to our side? Like, we just don't know. There were so many uncertainties that we were like, uh, hey, when something goes wrong, yeah. And uh, there was a time that they didn't even really like kind of attend to us because they had to attend to women with kids and pregnant women as well. It was a struggle. It was a struggle. But yeah, I'm grateful that we actually made our way. Uh, even after we actually even finished, hey, God, God. After we finished at the border, we finally entered into the Slovakian border. <sighs> we were there for, for a few more hours because they had to give us a pass so that it could you know, enable us to enter their country. That one took so long, and I think because we we're not wearing masks, they told us to go and stand outside under the cold sea. Midnight, especially during winter, it gets really, really cold. It was so cold. But I think in Russia, that we are safe, and I hope that other people who are still trying to find them the means to like, you know, leave Ukraine, leave their successfully, and I pray that peace be restored back into the country because <sighs> the experience was not nice. Because even after we left, to get a apartment to sleep there, no problem. Like, it took us a whole day to actually, like, kind of find a place where we were actually going to stay. So yeah, I just started to make this video to update you guys as well how we left because ah, uh, I remember an immigration officer wanted to actually stop me. The immigration officer wanted to stop me. I'm like, no, you cannot stop my shine. It's not possible. You cannot stop my shine. I'm leaving. Assuming I allowed him to stop me, I'm sure that I would not have made it out of there that night because you have to be smart. You have to be smart. But yeah, like I said, all thanks to our student union, the presidents, the officers, they really actually really loved. They did a lot. And I keep thinking about it that assuming we did not actually um as mean they did not come up with the idea of having a student you know what would have happened a lot of us would have stopped there because someone like me i don't really need really, like how friendly you can get back to normal so everybody can go back to the normal life they gave us what there was water there was pampas for people who had babies um don't worry i'll just insert the video so you guys can see but yeah, i just want to say thank you so much i'm going to the next few videos you guys are going to the same will be videos of me being in this place and maybe another place I go to. I'm going to put the videos I filmed when I was in Ukraine on hold. When we finally go back to Ukraine, I'll start uploading that again. But right now, no, I'm not uploading that because my second country is not at peace. When the country is at peace, they will upload Ukraine vlogs. But right now, I'm just going to keep them on hold and then you know, upload the ones that I'm making currently. So that's why I decided to update you guys and also let you know that I'm safe. Thank you all so much. Please don't forget to subscribe to my channel. Now it is important. Yeah, I'm safe. Thank you all so much for watching my video. Please share this video with your friends. Don't forget to like my video. Subscribe to my channel now. This is a video because why have you not subscribed? I need to understand. I need to know why have you not subscribed to my channel. So click on that red button down below and then press the notification button so you can get notified every single time I upload a new video. Like my video. And so we'll see you next time. Stay safe for Jojo because Jojo is what? You can see. Bye